themselves back to the channel. Zoe 101, the 2005 sitcom, is set to make a return with a movie, a reunion movie that is going to be rumored to be called Zoe 102. How creative. But obviously, there is good news and bad news. The bad news is only ever so slightly. It is going to be coming to Paramount Plus. Um, Jamie Lee, Jamie Lynn Spears is set to return alongside most of the main cast. The only ones that are, I mean, this is the bad news in a sense. The only ones that are not set to return are Victoria Justice and Austin Butler. Austin Butler, because of his amazing, he's just played Elvis for God's sake. He's not going to return to Zoe 101. Uh, the cast members I do know, Christopher Massey, he is set to return. I believe Sean Flynn is set to return, Matthew Underwood, and a couple of others. Obviously, Victoria Justice is probably the bigger character who people are probably going to be surprised about who's not returning. There is no confirmation whether the likes of Dan Snyder will be involved, obviously because he was a bit of a creep back in the day. But yeah, early days of announcements, but Zoe 101 will be back, I believe, most likely next year. Um, yeah, I think this is awesome. You know, I never really, I can never really remember Zoe 101 in complete. You know, it came out in the period of Drake and Josh. Uh, Victorious came sort of after it. So that's what Victoria Justice went on to. And your Icarlis and your Keenan and Kells and, uh, you know, all those things. So very happy about this. I hope it's actually decent to watch and to watch it 17 years or 17 plus years. 18 years, 19 years after the original release is going to be huge. So what are your thoughts about seeing Zoe 101 back? The main thing is Jamie Lynn Spears is back. Obviously, the series wouldn't work if she hadn't returned. So grateful for that. Did you watch this? If not, why? And if you did, what did you think so? Let me know down below in the comments and we'll talk soon. Goodbye.